hey everyone and welcome back to my channel on today's video is gonna be a few things um, a haul a, a small Sephora haul and a small Disneyland haul if you know from the vlog last time um, I went multiple times a couple times to Disneyland because they have a sales but I didn't buy a lot um, yep and then the second half of the video will be on this look this is the makeup look that I'm wearing the the makeup that I bought from Sephora but it's not that much actually so let's get into it all right so let's get started with the Sephora first because I only buy two things from Sephora um, so now now currently I'm into the deep color um, of red right so I decided to go and buy new things new colors not new things just a new colors so i bought these two this is the sephora brand this is in the color crayon no this is in the color 25 coral sunset so this is one of my lips it looks orangey more orange on the video compared to like in the real life so yep i just showing so that's the color it's very creamy I really like it and then the other one this is in the color plum dramatic plum 06 it's like a dark plum berry color and this is what on my cheeks I can't tell if it's there or not I'm sure it's there but sometimes in the camera you sort of like got washed out so this is what on my cheeks today so if I is a cream products so it was that color it's more pinkish deep pink red color love this so I'm loving this color at the moment and because you buy they are on sale at the moment I think it's like a summer sale so because you buy the Sephora brand you'll get this for free which is cute I can use this for travel and then on to the Disneyland so they are having a sale 35% for the gold annual pass I am a gold, gold holder <laughs> not platinum um, gold holder so I get 25% that was like even more than like a birthday sale so on your birthday you'll get like 20% off but this one is 25 which is crazy but I didn't buy it a lot though so first thing that I bought is this so this year I'm planning to go to Shanghai and Japan for the Disneyland um, so I was like maybe I should buy one that is like a classic mini Mickey head gear <laughs> you can't even see yeah that's it so this is one of it um, I think this one is like 150 so you got like 100 ish so yeah I never pay this for the whole price because Disney stuff can be pretty expensive so that's that put it there yeah you can see next one I bought is this this is only for $30 HKD this is Dale so you put here on your shoulder I have two already Mm, both are Elsa related so this one is not Elsa related so it's something else and it's brown so it's cute yeah this one I bought is this Elsa <laughs> this is a, a fridge magnet but I think I'll change it to the keychain so I have a hook that I can put it on here and then change it to a keychain but this is Elsa this is a 59 so Minus 25 percent off. It's so cute. I like the, I like the the costume. That's that. And the next one is the pin. This is a Cinderella pin. This is only for thirty dollars. I think originally it's like eighty, ninety or something. Um, yeah, nothing fancy. I usually put this on my bag. So this is Cinderella. Last but not least, I got this. So this has no sales because this is a new item. So this is, um, I got from the mystery box. So from the mystery box, you get 
I think like eight options that you possibly get and then you don't know which one you got and I got anger which is so cute he's so cute <laughs> so that's it all right but I'll say that if you want to buy something which is usable from Disneyland I'll say buy this one I bought on my friend's birthday because um, you will get 20% 20, 20 because that's the most that you get on the sale and yeah it said like Disneyland I think this one is like 1000 and this hole a hot and cold water more than eight hours it's still hot and it's still cold for more than eight hours so I'll say if you want to buy something one thing you want to buy from there buy this one you know and I'll bring this around a lot so yeah that's that that's all on the haul I don't buy a lot um, I'm trying not to buy a lot because I'm going on a lot of trips this year um, but there's still a few things that I want to buy and it's definitely the thing that I'll bring with me to the Disneyland Shanghai and Tokyo like I'm not planning to buy anything maybe one or two things from the other Disneylands but um, other than that it's just because like the trip gonna be expensive already um, with the pass to go in with the fast pass for each ride that kind of stuff it's gonna be crazy and then if you go to Japan if you go to the Disneyland you will go to Disney Sea as well so that's two theme park which you know money and then to Shanghai because how big it is and that kind of stuff yada yada um, yeah you on to the next part of the video is gonna be on this look I hope you enjoy it I'll see you in the next video thank you for watching guys Bye. I, um, I already have all my skincare I did my Medi Hill Medi Hill Medi Cube Medi Hill Medi Hill um, treatments with a serum and I have my um, sunscreen so I'm using Beauty of Justin sunscreen and now I'm gonna start with the makeup um, I'm gonna use this Peripera Milk Blur Rosy Tone Up so it has like a slight pinkish uh, I don't know if you can see but it's like a pinkish so usually I'll do like a three fingers like this right and then I'll go just a little bit so that it will apply thinly which is unlike the foundation kind of stuff. All right, and then for foundation, I'm gonna use this Maybelline Fit Me Fresh Thin Foundation in 04. This is like my color. So I'm gonna use this um, and I'm gonna apply with this sponge. I really like this sponge. It's very soft and stuff. And because this is slightly, slightly lighter than my skin color, so I'm just gonna focus. On my tone, which the one that get the most light. On my that's that, and then I'm gonna go a little bit with this color because this foundation is slightly. See, I hope you can see that. So this give a little bit more coverage um, because that one is thin, and this warm up a little bit. I'm saving on this because this is the one that I bought from Malaysia so I'm not going back to Malaysia anytime soon so I have to save up um, yes all right so that's that let's go on to the bronzer I'm sorry if I'm looking at the side because I'm looking at the viewfinder as my mirror And the most exciting part, um, I'm gonna use this new product by Sephora. It looks lighter in the camera, but it's slightly darker. So it's just like a deep plum berry color. Look at that, so pretty. So if I do that, oh my god, that's so pretty. So that's the color so I'm into this color at the moment I went to buy this one and this this is the lip liner I don't want to buy the whole lipstick 
this is the lip liner and this is the blush color because I don't have anything other than like a peachy color so I'm gonna use this just tap it a little bit I think I think it should be fine so let's go Ooh. oh my god it's so pretty Is it too much? No, it's not. Right? There's just a flash of color. Right? <laughs> well, I believe so. Alright. So that's the blush. And let's go into the eyes. This color from here. These two. These two combinations. But I didn't feel want to use this because my blush is already like deep red so I don't want to go all red on my face so I'm gonna do brown so I'm gonna go back to this Morphe color this is my trusty brown palette a neutral brown palette so I'm gonna go with this one and then start with the light color And then using the same color under all right and then i'm gonna go with another brush and then i'll go with this one this is more warm brown and then focus on the outer corner Dead. and I think I'm gonna go a tad bit darker so I'm gonna go with this one with a pointy brush so I'm just gonna tap it a little bit I believe this brush I bought from Korea if it's not from Olive Young it's from Daiso but I think this one looks fancy so it's from Daiso love 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 the colors all right so that's that and i'm gonna go with this one i'm just gonna go with my fingers and then apply next i'm gonna go with the eyeliner this is from merle is it from merle i think p1 oreo this is from it looks like it's from merle I'll use this and then for the lashes I'm gonna put this one first so this is like a lash serum from what is it it's like holika holika bought this from Seoul as well like from korea and i really like it so if you want to go and buy because this is so famous i think you only can buy two at the same time so i bought two last time when i was there so i still have it i'm planning to go one more time this year mm. can you hear there's rain all right so that's the eyes for the lips well that's that's gonna dry i'm gonna go with the lips i'm gonna use chapstick and then i'm gonna use this lip liner <laughs> i'm so excited all right got it so this is a sephora brand this is in the color <laughs> Cora, yes 25 color sunset so it's kind of like a deep red all right excited so this is like retractable crayon lip liner so i'm gonna use this it looks very compared to this one and i'm gonna top up with the romance 
lip oh, it's just like glassing water gloss this is so pretty Wait. Oh. and it has like a minty finish that's it now I have all the swatches Um, I think for my eyelashes, I'm gonna put like a falsies, and this one is just an individual. I'll get back in a minute. Alright, so I have my lashes on. Can you see? I only put one. <laughs> I didn't feel like I want to wear lashes, but at the same time, I don't wear lashes. So usually I have three each, but today I'm just gonna wear one because why not? And then I'm gonna use the Giverny. Mascara. I'm hoping it doesn't look that weird to have just one <laughs> single lashes in the middle, but I think that's enough, right? Okay, so this is the finished look. Yep. So I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you next video, guys. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.